Welcome back everyone! We have three quests here in the Misty Mountains, all in the same general direction. Therefore it's time for us to go out and complete them. And this is up in Gobblezon. Gobblezon? Well, Gobblezon seems sounds closer to what might be right, but I'm sure that someone will know a ten times better way to pronounce it. Okay, perhaps I'm not looking for a better way to pronounce it, but a more accurate way to pronounce it would be more in line with what I'm looking for. I'm sure some people have better ways to pronounce some words that we know very well aren't normally pronounced that way. Now, one of the reasons why they added that camp that we were at, the Hive Pass Camp, is it's a relatively new campsite that came with Update 13, is that it's a lot closer to this place than the old one is. So you don't have to go back and forth from Gloin's camp whenever you go back and forth here. All right, so that's the sign that we needed to put up now we need to take care of these guys and what you mean there is no quest to kill dower hands all right I do have to okay go to the cornerstone and take care of this last ingot New deed where giants dwell. Well, fortunately, there aren't any giants here. Instead, there are dour hands. Alright, so we'll take care of them. And we want to go to the cornerstone first. Since that is our. I think that's the door I want right there. We can't, so we couldn't help going there first. Right, and we'll take this, we'll give ourselves a little. And what do we have inside? A guard, that's what we have inside. Oh, uh, you expect at least one guard here. All right. And there's our cornerstone right there. Now, why one would put the plans to their secret doors inside of the cornerstone? I guess maybe they figure that anyone who'd have access to this Cornerstone will normally be someone who has the right to access the information and after several centuries someone may have forgotten it, so perhaps that's the reason why. But you would think the Dower Hands will know about it also. Alright, and here are the Gobbles on Plans. So we have the plans. We posted the sign. We had trouble getting out of the door. So now we want to find the other strong box. Which I believe is somewhere in this direction. Yeah, I know, I know. I got this little arrow pointing to me in the direction also. But I've done this quest enough times that I know where the next quest giver is. So that's not necessarily safe to depend on that because the next step after that, after this, they moved. Oh, 
which we'll go into in a moment after I take care of these tower hands. Deed bestowed. Oh yeah, of course, that where the giants. The crazy thing. Because in there, that goes into the giants valley right there. Is that the giants valley or is it, or is it the one after that goes, goes in? I think there's one more stage before you actually hit the Giant's Valley. When you enter, the, enter into the Giant's Valley, you run into all these elite giants and stuff like that. Oh. That's not where I wanted to go. Actually, I have to go through this first door first. Yep, I know it by heart, don't I? Alright. Take care of a couple more of these dwarves. Specifically, dower hand dwarves. So, if you're an elf with some inner tension against dwarves, I suggest you go on a rampage against dower hands to work out the aggression. Ah, here we go. How about that? I want this strong box. What do you need? Who dares to enter the tomb of Halmer Stone Shaper, son of Vither of old? Not even a dour hand is foolish enough to enter here. They know the tale of the sharp shapers and quake in fear. Yet, you're not a dwarf, so you're certainly not a dour hand. You are here for the strong box, aren't you, thieving elf? Your only moments to tell your tale before I cleave you in twain. Uh, I was sent here to fetch it by a dwarf. Will you stay and speak with me a moment? I see, and I bet you even claim to just have gained some rep with Thorns Hall. Friend, huh? Okay. Well, okay, a friend of Thorns Hall is a friend of mine, then. I see. So, you were sent by a dwarf from the Blue Mountains, were you? Perhaps it is a long years alone here. But I believe you for some reason. Now, allow me to tell my tale. Long ago, the first Halmerstone Shaper, son of Vitha, was charged with guarding the treasures here. He stood sentry day and night, maintaining his post, even on days of feasting. Yet, he let his guard drop only once, and a vile dwarf, Hutur Dourhand, slipped in and stole a single ingot of dwarf gold. Having failed in his duty, Halmer swore that he and his sons would keep vigil over the remaining gold until that ingot was returned. <laughs> I am but one of a long line of Halmers who have kept this oath. So in other words, you have been staying here for generations on generations, naming your sons the same name all this time. Now, I'm just wondering where you found a dwarf woman who was willing to produce this heir, but that's an entirely different matter. If you return to the stolen ingot, the oath will be fulfilled. The strong box will be yours to return to the dwarf who sent you. I cannot say, though, where you'll find Hothor, although the legends of Halmer failure tells that Hothor is somewhere within Gab. Gabilizan. Perhaps you will be able to find the gold. <laughs> now, that's the change there. Because now he's found within Gabilizan. While in the past, well, he wasn't within Gabilizan in the past. In the past, you had to go through that gate there. And, well, that dower hand right there isn't too tough. You will eventually run into some giants. I'm just showing you how not so tough he is. And then we'll get on track.
But I think that giant is that giant well is there another layer? Oh no, this is where the giants start right there. Okay. So you see there you had this so I always had to go around trying to bypass that giant. Which made things a lot tougher. Because you had to go around him, find some way. Sometimes I would go around to where you put the giant sign, which is a the third leg of the quest with the signs posted, where we just finished our second leg of it, or at least the posting of the sign of the second one. So there's another pass on the other side. And what you would do is you go in through there. And you could more easily sneak around the giant. Or sometimes I'd go through here and just run like mad. Or if you're a burglar, you stealth through all sorts of different methodologies you could use to get around it. But it's very much going into an area where there are many, many elites, so they decided to make things a little bit more soloable here by moving him inside the keep where the solo mobs are. That way they could still have the giant area left for group play, which is good. And we'll take care of these two guys. And we'll continue our battle. Trouble is with this with damage stances that you don't get too many good Actually, while I was in battle I guess I could have. Hit the longer heal. Alright, and there's the chest that contains the ingot. Well met. Ha! You've come f from one of those foolish stone shapers, haven't you? You've heard the tale of their oath over the strong box, haven't you? Well, allow me to tell you a tale. Yeah, I know, we get one from both sides. The first who through Dowerhand stole the gold, not for his own treasures, but to make Halmer Stoneshaper look the fool. Upon hearing of Halmer's oath, Arthur swore one of his own. He and his sons will forever keep the ingot and forever keep the stone shapers looking the fool. I too come from a long line, a line of the Horther Dowerhands, and I shall keep to the oath. You shall only have the ingot if you can take the strong box off my dead body. And I don't think that's too likely. Yeah. Obviously, we've got a battle now. I shall not break your oath. You shall not have the ingots. There we go. So... That's a rather strange one. We, we've got these two crazy lines of dwarves. Each of them having their own little oath. No, no, I don't use this one too often. It takes forever to cast. And we found a not only we found a page from the Whispers of the Dark, so he had something for me too. But there is this last ingot. All right, now. All right, what did I get? Just one. Ah! You are really out to get me, aren't you? 
Hello, hello, it's you. Welcome to the battle. Let me stun you. Now that was an epic. Con well, not quite a conclusion. More of a penultimate than a conclusion. All right, let's see. Come on! <laughs> I was just blasting out and he manages to throw his shield in front to not only block the thing, but to bash me in the face. Really, that is rude. Well, of course, they're dower hands, of course, they're always rude. Now here, that's... I think scribe a new ending. Oh, that's right. Now, now I remember what they changed. They said that in update 14, it won't require me to be armed anymore, which would be good. Well met. My eyes must betray me, you elf, you trickster. You cannot have stolen the ingot have the that has kept me from the kin chain to this place so long, and yet, yet, can it be so? Has it been done? Ooh. He slowly goes and returns the ingot. I can hardly believe the oaths have been fulfilled. Be at peace, ancestor. The treasures are reclaimed. I'm not sure what I'll do with myself now. The oath I've done. Perhaps I'll join my kin in the Blue Mountains. Oh well, it matters not. Because for the first time, I'm able to go wherever I choose. Uh, now where do I go? And you'll just let me go and take the chest. <laughs> okay. Now I can leave. Uh, assuming I can get through the dower hands. Yeah, it looks like there are one or two following me right now. Well, maybe three or four. Or maybe even five or six. <laughs> maybe you're running. Nah, it looks like the bird ignored me. Alright. But we may get a bear thrown in for the mix. Right, now behind the bear, and I think I'll get there safely, where we will turn in this quest. We're after several generations. We haven't waped in. What do you want? You... You have returned! And I know I need not ask if you posted the sign I gave you, for you have a trustworthy... You are a trustworthy elf indeed. I have fashioned another sign for your post. I am... I see from your eyes that you expected it and are eager to assist again. Oh, yeah, wait. Will you help me? Of course, this one's a fellowship quest, and it's supposed to sign... Well, I'll... So I'm not going to bother reading. Basically, he explains why he's posting a sign to warn against evil giants. Lasting. I am at your service. Good, good. I hope the strong box wasn't too hard to find. Hecky Gold Watcher is sure to be pleased with this. Those records of his won't have a bad thing to say about me. Now, I hope you already done so much, but perhaps a bit more could be I can ask of you. Oh, and what does this guy want now? 
Hmm. Oh, I have such... Oh, those Grove Tender gloves are so nice. Let's see. Eh, nothing particularly useful. So let's just get the thing that's most valuable. I would be grateful for your assistance. There's but one thing left to do. Take the strong box to Hickey Goldwatcher at Thorns Hall. Yeah, that's right. He wants me to go to Thorns Hall. So I'll take that there the next time I have an opportunity. Hmm. You got a map to the Spring Festival, map to Bree for the anniversary. Maybe I should have taken that map to the treasure hunt event. Since that would have been nice and close to Thorns Hall, I should have thought of that. Now these things here, they're Mind my words, fellowship Trevor. quests. Might you spare a moment of your time? And they're not forwarding me to the next area. One would think that they would. Oh, into the high pass. There it is. Come. But stay. we'll save that for next time when we will go into the high pass. But first, I probably want to make a little detour to Thorns Hall, but that will be for our next episode of Pineleaf Plays The Roomkeeper.